Hey, what's up? How's it going? I just wanted to uh, show you this. You know, I'm sure you've seen it everywhere. Bosom attack. If you layer it right, you can make every single word be it. You know, it sounds like what is my dick or, you know, do you want to suck my pack? Be pretty, you know. Uh, you could it like that and then make it back to yourself so then you can do it with yourself. You know, at least in the part where you have control of the environment. But yeah, this is basically the material I'm speaking of here. Um, it has kind of a fish smell, but it's not fish. It has kind of a regular bland smell. I think I'm just making it smell like fish. But it's it's, uh, it's yam. But I think that it, um, you know, probably, you know, basically like uh, taking the pre-p and the pre-p of both of the um, Texas and then putting it together into a substance which would slosh around a little bit denser than water, which would basically be the solid of, uh, you know, creatable solid. I mean, if you could just imagine that you could make anything out of this and you could literally, you know, turn it into something, and you definitely can. It does bend and it does take on uh, different shapes. And it can definitely you know, be moved, and if it was a little bit better, you know, I'm sure that it could. But anyway, <clears throat> another thing you can look at is just um, eating a piece of chicken, and how, um, kind of like this too. And, you know, also the obvious fact that, uh, You know, it's jiggly, and you can make sex sounds with it, too, which is what I do, you know, before I write, you know. I mean, I think about it, you know. I wouldn't want to put just an insole of a shoe, you know. I mean, I just, I would rather it be where this material here is actually a mathematical equivalent and is, you know, a physical equivalent of how much comb I can make come out of people. They can look better and be younger and good, you know. I mean... That would be one of my goals, you know, and really just to get people wet all day long and get myself wet all day long, you know, and not really, you know, it's not really limited to uh, anal juice as well. I think it, you can definitely get yourself juiced for sure. And it would probably be, you know, something to do with this equivalent, probably just about more about touch or maybe just how jiggly it is, you know, maybe it would just measure how much of that is going on and then it would you know display the uh, progress and I thought it would just display accidents you know that could possibly happen while it was happening because if you think about sex too much uh, there are backing up issues if you have a really long metaphorical um, soul you know because, I mean, if you're really doing that while you're doing something, I think that would be a problem. All right. Leering penis. Yeah, I mean, you can be like... But what I'd like people to be able to do if they could, and it's too weird, but uh, needs to be done. We should have it where you know you can actually teach people lessons, but it just seems to be a little bit too inconvenient for me. But I mean, if it's just because you know if I teach someone a lesson, it'll probably unteach the lesson. But if I could, you know, I'd probably 
I'll probably make people buy like into these one for each person and then everyone sits down and uses their hands and is like you know how their hand would be if they had to like shake someone's hand or see how much they you know want something or you know don't have you know or can grab with their hand you know so they know how to deal with that distance of air that pushes against the body you know, with just wind. I mean, if you can get wrinkles from wind, but you can't get rid of the wrinkles from wind, you know, then you need to know how. But that's that's what it should be like, is like you're talking to people like that. 